In this video, let's talk a little bit about why we would get a CT scan and what we are looking for when we get CT scans. CT scans are a type of x-ray machine, but giving us much more detail and quality of image, and also 3D slices of the human body. CT is really good for looking at bone and bone anatomy, for bleeding, and for any areas where there's calcium in the body. When we get a CT scan, we are oftentimes looking for evidence of fracture. We're looking for bleeding, such as bleeding inside of the brain. It's very common with a patient that's had a head trauma to get a CT scan to look for bleeding in the brain. Another thing in spine that we will commonly get a CT scan for is to evaluate for fusion. CT scans do not show the ligaments very well. They don't show the brain and the spinal cord as much in detail as an MRI scan, but they're also a lot faster to get. So the CT scan is used commonly in the emergency room and in situations with trauma, whereas MRI, which takes longer, does afford greater detail, might be done more in the outpatient setting. We use CT scans all the time. Patients are subject to a small amount of radiation therapy. I don't think it's clinically significant unless it's a young patient that's getting multiple scans during their lifetime. Many of the advances in medicine have come alongside the advent of CT scan, especially advances in trauma. So in a nutshell, that's what we're looking for when we get a CT scan, primarily bone and bleeding.